Welcome back, citizens of Freeport and Stevenson County. I'm Mayor Jody Miller, and joining me today, Craig Benjamin from the Stevenson County Health Department. And we just wanted to talk a little bit about testing today. We don't have a whole lot of information, but we just wanted to put out there what we do know. Craig, talk, talk to us about testing. The testing, the actual test kits is on limited supply. And what we do is we have to prioritize who gets tested. Mm -hmm. uh, there are uh, certain criteria. One is that you're ill and we test you at the uh, two local hospitals. Uh, you could be tested if you are a direct contact of a positive case. And then the third one is if a physician is ordering it and they feel that it is absolutely necessary, then we do that. Do you um, see that um, Freeport and Stevenson County will get more tests as time comes in, uh, the availability of more tests? I believe that we will have more tests, but it's not going to be very quick. Okay. We've gotten a lot more tests now, which we'll find that our positives and negatives of the numbers will go up. The state has uh, um, contracted and had facilities in Rockford. There's three in Rockford that uh, have test sites and then also in Sterling Rock Falls. So there's more state sites set up. Now, does that mean that there's going to be more tests? Yes. Mm -hmm. Will we get more test kits? Always hard to tell. Mm -hmm. And then there's the uh, rapid testing that they'll speak of. And that's um, something I'll say relatively new. It works, but it's not as reliable. We find that there's at least uh, 30 percent false uh, negatives and false positives uh, but they, it does have promise because you can find out a result in 45 minutes instead of uh, two or three days right and so our numbers uh, positive numbers have gone up a little bit lately um, but our percentages have stayed pretty much the same I mean obviously when you have more tests available you are going to have more that are going to come back as positives but we're still ranging in that 95 percent range of negatives that's correct mm -hmm. yes so that's that's actually a good thing what about um antibody testing do you see that coming into that, the area that will be coming soon uh, soon meaning probably a couple months from now I think the emphasis now is the, the absolute testing of right. negative and positive antibodies sure that will come um, I would say that that's probably going to be here before vaccines will be here mm -hmm. and that's vaccines are probably a year out that's, that's quite a ways out yeah so so the point is um, w when we can get them we will have them yes yeah okay um, anything else about testing? Well, uh, we're increasing the testing in, in different locations. Mm -hmm. um, we do have um, facility, business facilities that uh, across the state are increasing the number of positives, and so that's what we have been working on. So it's really not a good idea to load up 10 people in your van and drive to Rockford to no. be tested. No, no, not a good idea. No. Not a good idea. And we're finding that um, this will increase within a business very quickly. Mm -hmm. And we work with uh, facilities and businesses in the county. And cur currently we have three that we're working with. Yeah. And we um, get notified, we contact the positive case. We actually talk with that particular case. And we get contacts, every contact that you could think of that you've had. Mm -hmm. And we work with uh, the business to say, it's not just home contacts, it's where you have uh, your position in a building or a business or a factory, who do you come in contact mm -hmm. with? And that's where we begin to, what we call contact. So, so just so the public knows, you are monitoring a few businesses and, oh, absolutely. and going in that direction. Um, and there is even a business that has voluntarily closed down temporarily just for the safety of their employees. That's correct, mm -hmm. yes. So, okay, well thank you. And, and again, as always, check our Facebook, check our website, wash your hands, keep your distance, and stay home if you're sick. Have a good day. Thank you.